not the end of the world. During times of crisis, it has been easy to find Christians proclaiming that the end is near. Their motivation might be good, but their theology is not. In the Acts of the Apostles, chapter 1, verses 1 through 11, we hear Jesus replying to the disciples, It is not for you to know the times or periods that the Father has set by his own authority. When Christians imagine that a given natural disaster or plague is a sign of the end, they are usually trying to motivate other Christians to action. But Jesus' words show us the problem with this way of thinking. If it takes the end of the world to motivate us, maybe we haven't really heard the gospel yet. Jesus continues, But you will receive power when the Holy Spirit comes upon you, and you will be my witnesses to the ends of the earth. Jesus contrasts the equipping of the disciples for worldwide mission with their desire for details about the end. In other words, what you would do to preach the gospel today if you knew the world would end tomorrow is what you should be doing anyway. For more stories, please visit our website, www.pamphletstoinspire.com.